everybody, I'm Tracy. I'm Danielle. And we have just had the Spawn Birds print go live on the website. We have got this, it's monotone, what we're talking monotone colors coming through with the beautiful off-white and black. And it's almost like uh, when you get in the close, it reminds me a little bit of a houndstooth. We're speaking about sort yeah. of a modern day enlarged houndstooth. And we're gonna show you mix back with different colorways as well as with the simple black and white like we've got it on at the moment. And we hope you enjoy. Take right, right. I go. Yes. So I've just got, oh, I'll just move that up there. Okay. Just got, um, got it on with the Miranda. I just wanted to show you beautiful Hansel um, in the beautiful petrol color. So just showing you back with the black Miranda. Loving that beautiful clean line that I'm getting um, through the front there. And then you're just seeing the pop of color in the top and then the print through in the pant. But today is an exciting day for us because it's our first printed Monroe pant ever. Yay! Actually, can't believe it. We Ooh, have had too. so many printer pants. We generally have Presley's, Daddy's um, available as prints as well as the Toadies. And not sure what took so long. <laughs> no. Don't really understand what happened there. But a lot of us are doing a little dance of joy today because we have um, Monroe's available in a print. Now, if you're not familiar with the Munro pants, they're a straight style pant made from our dry touch jersey fabric. So they've got beautiful stretch to it. And they are a pull on style with the soft waistband that literally stays in place all day once mm. you've got her on. Key measurements definitely take your hip and your waist measurement and work out in between there what size you should be wearing. I'm measuring a 14 in the hip and I'm at 12 at the waist. I'm wearing a 14 in these today. They just feel more comfortable and you can see that because there's that beautiful sort of what we call gel tape that's on the inside, it creates that, um, it allows it to stay in place throughout the day without having an elasticated look. So there's no gatherings through there, really smooth. Pockets on the side there, and then as I mentioned, straight hem with quite a deep hem as well. Mm. I'm 176 centimeters tall, and as I mentioned, I'm wearing size um, 14 in the pants today. So let's have a look at the print. So you can see black base, and then the color on top, it is more, I'm gonna say, what were we were saying today, it's like an off-white, yeah. you know, not quite cream, um, almost milky you were color. saying a bit of a milky color, mm. Haley. Yeah. And um, so we, but definitely we'll show you back with white so you can see it. I don't think it makes a difference. We found that when we stood next to the white wall, the color seemed to go a bit darker. When I put the black jacket on it, the white seemed to get lighter. Kind of is, we want to say black and white, <laughs> but we're just saying the white isn't the starkest of whites. Yeah. It's definitely more that sort of creamy color coming through there. And then with that underneath, we've got the lines underneath are sort of, like I said, it's that nod to houndstooth in a way, like an enlarged houndstooth. And then we've got that, that other detail that's sitting along the top there um, that's giving it the shape. And even as I stand to the side, it almost feels like it's forming a little bit of a stripe. It's not really a stripe, but it's giving that idea Thank of you. a stripe going through on top of that. Oh yeah, um, I see that now. You see that yeah. on top of these sort of exaggerated um, yeah. houndstooth. I'd probably see it in the dress. I think you're just seeing it more in the pants because the um, pants are straight up and down. Um, but really, really um, very striking is what I want to say. And we're going to show you paired back with some more traditional colors as well as the other colors you've got. Because just showing you how you can take those monochrome um, colors. Not sure why I said monotone at the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> as I said it, I was like, this is not the right word. The right word will come to me soon. Um, so just taking those colors and then incorporating them into your wardrobe because to be honest if we had had time because we we could have paired this back with so many pieces yeah. i would have i would wear this with my little red shoe oh yes mm -hmm. i really would mm -hmm. i love little black white and red and um with a little little black top so you could definitely have pops um pops of color on here and have lots of fun i've got it on with the hansel feels so snugly in our beautiful bamboo it's in the petrol bamboo so you can see how i've paired it with that really dark green color with the black and I'm feeling very smart and I feel like, um, and super comfy. Well. Very sophisticated. Yes, thank you. I'm um, feeling that. I'm feeling that. <laughs> so, uh, interestingly, Tracy said about the, uh, the pop of colour. So, when I saw it was releasing today, I went, yes. Red lip. Yes. Yep. 
put on the red leather. I like this. That would look really, really lovely. Um, and I do love a little bit of black, white, and red as well. So I have got on the beautiful new Sandy dress. So I'll show you her in a minute. But I've just paired it with the black Kiva belt. Um, and if you haven't got one of these belts, they mm -hmm. are magical with the elastic waist at the back. So you've got lots of room. But of course, you buy your true size for this. And um, and uh, I think I said before, it just allows you to just gently expand during the day yes. <laughs> as we do um, and not feel like you're being cut in at all but uh, and I've got the lovely black Garcia staple jacket mm. that should be in everybody's wardrobe because she goes with everything and it's just the most divine luxe basic jacket that's going to go with everything that you own so I want to take you through the sandy dress though because she's just beautiful you said we don't have many sandy dresses and I said no. well why because yeah. she's such a pretty dress what did I say this is a very nice dress <laughs> yes. very lovely dress I love that I, I, I wore that quite a bit in the zen garden yeah which we released and stunning it's such a nice yeah style. it's just um got that little point of difference that really helps it stand out from a lot of the dresses that you're seeing out there on the street so what we've got is this beautiful um boat neck top and the lovely cross detail the front with a little keyhole which I think just gives a beautiful neckline yeah. it's really elegant um, and helps it warm my hair up today so you can actually see that <laughs> um, lovely boat neck detail and she's got a double layered bodice so we're smoothing all down the back as we like a midi do we say midi length midi length, um, full skirt and she's got pockets yes we love the pockets and also just for a little bit more confidence during the winter we've got the layering the um, um lining underneath yeah I mean, it's called lining underneath so um that's the sandy dress and i think you know while this is a this would be perfect at, at work and in the office dressed as i had it she's also a really pretty dress that you can take out either um to events or to dinner absolutely or to weekend. yeah really lovely actually i think this would look beautiful with the cape Oh yeah, the poncho oh, looks gorgeous. Yeah, you're lucky Beautiful. to get a poncho. If you're lucky to buy one, you actually need to get this to go with it. <laughs> yes. Yeah, but so that's the sandy dress. And do you um, want to show it without the belt too? Yeah, just you can accessorize thing. this dress, as Tracy was saying, with so many different colors. Change the boots to a, um, a lovely heel. You can go with any color because you've got that that neutral black and white base you can really go to town with your accessories. Yeah. So, you know, don't have to stick with the black heels. You can pop, pop on any color heel and it's gonna look really, um, really, you know, dramatic and different with this beautiful black and white base. Absolutely, Anne's just asking whether Sandy is a long sleeved tandy, bandy, I can't say it. Tandy? Tandy? tandy. I think so. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she is. I think it is. They rhyme, so they have to be that related. Tandy <laughs> is so yes. good. Yes, so. Kept on the printed pants, and for those of you, if you not haven't joined our group, please join. We've got a beautiful clothes community, and this is a space where you can see women sharing. And today we did, I did a post about printed pants because printed pants are a little bit of a phenomenon. We have ladies coming in for styling sessions, and I mentioned the ladies that have come in. We've had 17 ladies walk away with 25 pairs of printed pants between them, um, and generally the saying is. Oh my gosh, I didn't know printed pants was a thing. These feel amazing. They're wardrobe game changers, and they literally are. But please head along to our group. It's a great space, a great community where you'll get sneak peeks of the bits and pieces that are releasing so you can make up your mind before they release because quite a few pieces are limited. I've released that Sandy dress. Yes. It's definitely a limited release. Um, so it's a great community to be part of. So I've kept the pants on. And you can see it with the Dakota and the white bamboo. I just wanted to show you how I've gone for different styling, just back with the tan for a little bit more of a relaxed feel, or if you've got that sort of corporate, non-corporate, casual corporate kind of look. I'm paired back with the Garcia in the beautiful caramel color. But we have just released our Dakota top in the white bamboo. Thanks. I'll pop it here. So just showing you the Dakota in the white bamboo. If you're looking for that basic of that beautiful white long sleeve top. This is her for our Jamie lovers and our Emily lovers. Yeah. Dakota is the long sleeve version. So you see we've got a tailored tuck through the front and the back there's a yoke and um, a bit of a gather detail there so that we can have beautiful tailored shape to the side. This is an elevated white tee is how I want to call her 
or if you're looking for that um, white shirt that doesn't have a collar, this one is perfect. You can see, look gorgeous under the um, Garcia jacket. I love it underneath that um, with that V neckline. I think works beautifully, but super comfortable. Yeah, it looks so good. Mm. We have so many people asking for a white Dakota as well, yes. and this is this is it. Feels beautiful on, um, and so just showing you the white again back with the pants so you can see the color coming through you definitely can wear your white shirts with this even though the white is not um, a stark white on here you're not necessarily um, noticing it's kind of like when you wear a few different tones of black you can have that and not wear it when you're wearing different textures if you've got the black jacket with a different type of pants they're still black slightly different textures mm. that looks amazing i'm just oh. loving i'm just loving how we can just bring in different colorways and that looks sensational on the shoulders. Mm -hmm. She's setting the drama. <laughs> I love it. Adding the drama. Um, and I don't really need to with this outfit, but uh, I just wanted to show you how the pink morant looks beautifully it's paired. So with, good. Yeah. I even love the red lip with the pink and the berry. Oh, the pink it's and all, red. Yeah. Oh, it's so lovely. Days. Yes. Great combination. So that's obviously the pink moon. Let's take this off. So, I have on the same top that Tracy just had on, the Dakota, but obviously in the new Full Birds print. And um, as you can see, a really striking top. I am one of these people who pulls my sleeves up. Sleeve up. And sleeve Me up too, girl. Dan. Just Me too. <laughs> it just doesn't feel right to have stuff down around my <laughs> But um, I've popped around with the Brett in Mulberry. In Mulberry? Mm -hmm. Yeah, in Mulberry. And uh, oh, what a pretty top this is. Did you just talk through the features of this top, Tracy? She a little did. bit, but just looks so oh, different. Okay. <laughs> oh, great. I did. I did, I did. But that looks really smart tucked in. I do like it tucked in, but I'm really starting to enjoy the look of the top just out casually. Yeah. yeah it looks really it changes smart. changes the whole silhouette. It really does. It, it takes it to a really relaxed office vibe. Um, you know, if I wanted to go to a meeting, I might tuck myself in quickly on the way. But just, you know, at the desk and around for the day, the, the shirt out and the, you know, the shirt tail hemline just makes it sit beautifully on your body. So yeah. it's not just this straight, boring, you know, cut you off at the widest part. Um, and that looks yeah. so good. What size are you wearing in the top? I'm 169 centimetres tall and I'm wearing a size 10 in, um, in everything. Okay. okay, so yes. Those Bretts look really good. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm getting there with the Bretts. I wasn't convinced because I have so many other um, uh, styles that I love, love, love. Yeah. Um, that when I put these on, I went, no, 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 not for me. And then the, every time I put them on since, I thought, actually, <laughs> actually, I'm coming around. The colour is so good. Yeah. yeah. And they actually are really flattering. Yeah, I love the, the little bootleg. I think I've said before, um, I love the fact that you can take, put these on and off without taking any shoes off. Yes. <laughs> Particularly if you've got boots on. Great, quick change. Nothing better than you know, <laughs> whip them off and put them back on when you've got boots on. Do you want to show it with like the little suit? Yeah, Even beautiful. though it's probably the wrong size jacket, Daddy, but just to sort of show. Susan's also saying she's really loving the sleek hair today. Oh, thanks, Susan. Yeah. It does look great. It was just one of those days where I went, oh, try something different. Oh, I love that. Yeah, that looks great. Mm. Yeah. So good. Really smart. And if you're, um, you know, if you, want, if you want a suit that's different to everybody else is black and navy, um, and you just want to have something that, that helps you stand out from the crowd a little bit. Yeah. Mulberry's going to do it. Absolutely. Absolutely. And you can roll your sleeve in too. Like, I know for some people who um, have the sleeves are a bit too long. But I quite like the Metz and McKenzie jacket. I like it zhuzhed up onto what the size three is quarter. Size? I think so it's a 12. 12 jacket. Okay, so, so I would normally pick out a 10. This is the 12 on me. I don't feel like it's too big on me. Maybe a little bit in the in the sleeve yeah. length. But um, as we said, I'm a tucker. I'm a, I'm a, a zhuzh. Yeah, a zhuzh. So I would probably zhuzh. I love anyway. the zhuzh. Yeah. And... Um, I'm loving this colour. I'm loving this colour. Absolutely gorgeous. Talking about gorgeous. Oh, no, there's been a few, there's just been a little <laughs> bit of more wardrobe malfunctioning here. Oh, I'm just falling apart the seams <laughs> off camera. <laughs> I think she's <laughs> coming. Quite literally, I think. Yeah, so. <laughs> do you know what? Do I need to tap dance again? I've done it before. <laughs> I was just. Okay. Right. I'm back. <laughs> okay. So, I just wanted to show you this is our Heather dress, and I'll go into details with Heather. But this is our Sandro Jacardi, 
whom I feel like um, I'm not seeing many photos being shared in the group. She's been a little bit forgotten with her um, Sandra Ducati. This is just a great piece. It's a Ducati that's um, what it, it's a cardigan, striker jacket in our beautiful dry touch jersey base. So just showing you that over the dress when you're just wanting, especially when you if you're sitting at a desk, great comfortable piece for a desk job. Um, if you're sitting something you can keep in your bag or even something that you can keep on the back of your chair yeah it's a great easy piece when that aircon is just a little bit nippy which does happen yes. yeah yeah places. i cause i have the black sandwich pattern yes. in the back of my chair all the time yes. and then i also feel like this works quite well under a coat as well so just showing that beautiful petrol color as well so different petrol to what our bamboo is but just how um very simple very simplistic it is but mm. this is a i have a dress a little bit baba boom in this print and I feel like if you are conscious of your curves whether you're fuller in the tummy fuller in the hip or even fuller from behind this print is perfect for you because it's just all over the place yeah it's all over the place your eye doesn't know where to rest so what's happening is you're actually just getting your shape coming through in this and um, that's what I love a fitted style with a long sleeve it's just really giving you it goes and at your smallest part actually gets accentuated wherever that might be. So this is gorgeous Heather. So Heather is a functioning wrap dress and I've actually got on one of our um, slips underneath oh, nice. here. We've got the Maya reversible slips. They're a slip that you can either choose to wear as a v-neck or you can spin it around and have um, a round neck through the front. So I've got the v-neck so that it's not popping through but I've got the extra layer underneath. Now just to mention I've got the black slip on underneath here. We do have it in latte, we do have it in um, navy. navy as well, but I've gone with the black and you can't see any of the black coming through under the print. So I just wanted to show that to you in case you had concerns with the white on the print that you were gonna see your undies underneath. It's not gonna happen. I don't, look, I haven't tried it with red undies underneath, but with the black, I'm not seeing any differentiation um, coming through there. So this beautiful dress, she is a functioning wrap. So the extended waist ties is enough of them to wrap all the way around. Most of our dresses are like them. Some have shorter ties that just go to the side, but this is enough for you to wrap all the way around. And just showing, I do have that slip underneath and it does come in two different lengths. So there's the mini length and then there's a midi length. And I've got the midi one on today. Um, so it's just, just the perfect length for this dress. And I just feel, especially because it's cooler or if you're somewhere and your dress is blowing up, there's a lot of coverage on this. But if you are out and about in the wind, you've just got that extra little bit of layer underneath you um, if you have that happening. Now, really hard to see with this print, but these gorgeous flattering tucks over the front of your tummy. Yeah, you and can see the space there. Yeah. So beautiful flattering tucks over there. It's really great, especially if you're conscious of your tongue being a little bit full. There's something about the illusion of those tucks, even when we release this in a plain color, that you have that coming through there. And it just creates that little bit of detail over the tummy. Um, and you find that often you don't actually want to have anything flash across your tummy if you're conscious of it, because then it does highlight that. And you just have those tucks and it just creates that beautiful shape coming through here. Lovely little puff detail on the sleeve, just very small little gathers. So it just gives that little, you know, we joke around about the power sleeve, but it is just that little, little bit of shape, I want to say, mm. broadening through the shoulder and then great straight shape through the back. And a not, I don't want to say an accentuated tulip shape at all at the bottom, but just the way it wraps it, it curves through the front where the wrap is, it doesn't have a point. And we'll show you one of our other wrap dresses um, in a moment and you'll see just those little, little shifts of shapes that comes through there, but that's what makes this one the beauty that she is. Yeah. Long sleeves, she's sitting at that on me, just below the knee length, so she does sit that slightly little bit longer. Of course, there's no pockets in these ones because we want them to sit flush against your skin. Pop her on with a slip. You're looking, a little, bit, you're looking a little ladies rock chick. Yeah, I'm feeling yeah. it. Yeah. it is, <laughs> the black and white. Little, no, yeah, yes. <laughs> Absolutely. With a little, with your little uh, yeah. fish nets. Oh, that's and, exactly yeah. it. So just, Bringing those little bits of personality through, so I feel like with my black Garcia jacket, like I feel like I could go, I could go out for dinner mm. in something like this. Absolutely. But then pairing it back with a coat or something different, and even my pumps, then that's something that might be more work appropriate. So just having that piece that goes in between. But I think a great um, event dress, really good yeah. for if you're traveling, really good um, event dress. I just think in the black and white. Um, quite simplistic and then you're just bringing in your accessories um, mm. and a pop of colour mm. to go through. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to show you a really divine winter 
wardrobe um, combo. Uh, so I've got mm. the same Brett C. Mulgrew that I had on before, and of course the um, dusky pink red, which is just such, such a stunning look. Mm. Again, if you haven't touched this mode at all, yeah. <laughs> you don't want to take your hands off it. So I wanted to though show you the top. We've restocked our Avery in black. Oh. So it's in a dry touch jersey in black. This is just a classic, beautiful top yeah. that you are going to be able to wear so many different ways. You could dress it up, dress it down. I'd be wearing this for jeans on the weekend. But then I could put it with a really, like you could put it with one of the up late skirts. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and because it's got those beautiful bishop sleeves with the full sleeve and the cuff at the at the bottom, um, it's got bust ups to give you some shape through here. It's got this beautiful. It's not even a V. It's like a real soft V, like it's V neck, mm -hmm. but it's not a harsh. But it's really soft and fem feminine V. Um, beautiful detailing. Um, yeah, the gathers are gorgeous. The yeah, is that from the yoke? Yeah. And then it's just got that shirt tail hemline. So. I would really happily pop on, you know, one of the one of the up late Andy skirts with this and I think it would look really special, this top. It's one of those dress up. You know what it actually looked really nice with that um the silk the tie that we had yes. yeah, around your neck and the skirt. What a great little outfit that would be. Yeah. I'm dreaming I love here. That. But yeah, I love a black top because you can do so much with it. It's not just a black top in your wardrobe. It's a going out top. It's a work top. It's a weekend play top. Um, so just think outside the square with the stuff that, you, that you've that you got in your wardrobe. And don't categorise it into this is for work, this is for play, this is for going out. Um, because if you pair it different ways with different items in your wardrobe, it can be really multifunctional, which is what we're all about, isn't yeah. it? Making... Definitely. Yeah. I love that Avery too when you um, pull the sleeves up on that one. It gives that really nice big blouse. See, this is the one sort of top I wouldn't pull the really? sleeves Really? Yeah, oh, I because love... Because I love the drama of that big full I create sleeve. more drama by making oh, it. Oh, right. <laughs> I like drama. Hayley likes more drama. drama. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Over the top drama. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah they're fun. Yeah, really lovely. Yep, cool. So a very similar shape to what Danny just had on um, in the Avery is the Jasper. So all the same concept, but this has got that beautiful scoop neckline um, shape. So when you get to know the fit of the pieces and you go, oh yeah, that one works for me, you get you get used to knowing um, how when we can go for iterations of the sleeves changing, it's still the same th fit through the body, but we just have a few subtle shifts as far as sleeves go. So the same beautiful bishop sleeves, I love the shape of the scoop neckline, and it's got all those same features where we've got that show tail hemline, we've got the sh same um, shoulder yoke, um, through the back there, so it's that not to tailoring. It's just on this one, um, the the sleeves, they don't have um, like a big gather detail or anything on. It's just that beautiful soft bishop sleeve with the double cuff. It feels quite lovely. I feel a little bit out of breath from changing, yeah. just catching my breath. So I popped them on with the Monroe pants in petrol. So I had them on in the print earlier. So Monroe's we have available in black, in navy, that's a core product available most of the year round. And then we'll do our seasonal colours and we've just had the petrol and the beautiful um, mulberry colour release and of course our first print today which we're all very excited about. But this is also another beautiful option if you're not brave enough yet to try some printed pants, maybe try them in a different colour, something a little bit different. So this petrol colour I do love, it's, it's that sort of bluey green, it's a very tricky colour to describe. Um, but I love how it picks up with the black and white and it really shifts the tone because when Danny had it on with Mulberry in her bread pants to when I've got it on with this, it's I find it quite incredible how different the print Yeah, looks. the white's really popping now. Mm, really, um, it's, it's really a different piece I want to say. So just by having that one piece, so if you've invested in one of these tops, one week you're wearing it with your black pants, another week you're wearing it say with with mulberry and another week with petrol, it's feeling like two completely different outfits. Mm. And then depending on what coach you're having, because even like you saw earlier when I did that um, Sandro um, Ducati over, and we could even do that. I'll have a look um, how that works with the with the more bishop sleeve. But if you wanted to make the little twin set, so generally the trick is I always hold onto my cuff when I put it in a sleeve so that the cuff doesn't end up around my elbow. And then, <laughs> and then do the adjustment. But that is the little twin oh, set, yes. soft suiting, feels lovely, feels pretty luxe. 
um, feels really easy. Um, and this is, I think this is absolutely beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. We have these also in the black and navy. Um, so you could definitely make a little soft suit so the black pants and the black um, Sandra, but I think even keeping with the petrol and just even having the black over this um, would be beautiful. But this is just, when you're looking for those easy pieces, especially if you're gonna be out and about, if you're driving, if you find you're driving between appointments, these are great pieces mm -hmm. for that. Um, say instead of wearing a jacket while you drive, pop on something like this. Um, so great for driving or great for travel if you're in a plane. Um, but even if you're going from meetings to meeting, these are the kind of pieces that move with your body. They easy care, they feel amazing, and look gorgeous. Two, I'm going to join the print. pants. I'm joining the printed pants again <laughs> too. <laughs> and I feel like while you're standing here, because you're in the presses, before I go, we'll just sort of, I'll just discuss the difference in shape. So our Monroe pants, they're a straighter style and longer, whereas the Presley's, and I always say just think of Elvis, it's more of a flare at the bottom, <laughs> so a bit wider, and, they, and, and they're and crop. Yeah, they're definitely a little bit more, um, they, they move a lot more. I love Presley's, and you know, I wear them with boots all the time. But that's, um, that's just showing you, so you can just see with the two of us together, you can see how much straighter the Monroe is. Um, and then when you look at the Presley, you can just see how um, a little bit wider, but more flare at the bottom. Yeah. Yeah, and super fun. Mm. Like, and I love the press list too because they are just a little bit shorter. So as I said before, I'm one one sixty nine, and um, I can find I find these a really good length for mm. flats and heels. Um, not a problem. Uh, the Munros are also I can do the same, but they're just a little bit longer on me. So yeah, um, yeah Tracy's a fair bit taller than I am, but because. She's got the benefit of those beautiful long legs. <laughs> uh, I've got a long torso, but not so much the long legs. So anyway, I've got the Presley's on in the willow print, which is just the nice divine print we released a few weeks ago now. I love the blues that come through in this. While it's got, you know, light blue in it, it's still really um, wintry, sort of autumn type of uh, mm. print and yeah. shades. And you can pick up, as you see, I've got brown pumps on with these. You can pick up all of the darker shades and keep it really wintry looking. And I've got it on with the um, beautiful new, oh my gosh, this bamboo feels like heaven, the Dakota in um, white bamboo. Tracy, I had it on earlier. And I just wanted to show you this pairing because if you have this Morant in sage, this is just... Oh yeah, that's a lot great. combination. Helen was just saying she's 170 and she loves her Presley. Yeah, too. they're a really good high on us, one six, one, you know, anyone really but actually my mum's 163 I think mm -hmm. 163 and <laughs> Tracy's better um <laughs> and she loves the Presley's too because they're the perfect length on her right. they're perfect full length pant on her but how beautiful does this uh willow print look with this sage moran that's it's gorgeous that's just the most heavenly I mean I've got um the pumps on but I'd love to put it on with some brown boots yeah, big woolly scarf yeah. around your neck and you would be braving the cool, coldest weather in Melbourne or Sydney because we don't get it up here. <laughs> no, it's, uh, it's cold there, right? 15 degrees. It's, oh my gosh. It's, it's cold as it gets. We had winter, we had winter about a, about two weeks ago for a couple of days. We did. Yeah, we did. It's gone now. And we froze. Yeah, yeah, it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> we froze. We froze. We froze. So these are Bradley's in the... Um, Black, so I'm just saying, not Bradley's, Presley's. Presley's in the black. So just comparing the fit of what the Monroe, let me just so you can see the elongation of my leg. Com considering the fit of the, what the Monroe was on me, you can see more flare and you can see it's just sitting a little bit more cropped. So I've got the just above ankle boots on, um, and that is how, because as a tall woman, I still love Presley's and I generally wear them. I like wearing them with my tan boots, long tan boots underneath for that. Um, getting that little bit of contrast, but just wanting to show you with this beautiful wool up print, even though it's got a navy base, you can still definitely wear black with it. Don't feel like you have to wear um, your navy separates or bottoms with it. And this is our um, mason top, and I feel like we could make a mason top in anything. Yes. And she'll fly out the door. Absolutely. It's, it's a firm favorite, so I'll just show you slightly tucked in, because it, 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 as you saw, it does have a different shape to our other top. So Mason is still true to size. Taking measurements is still true to size, but the fit is quite different to anything you probably used to if you wear a lot of our other tops because it is more fitted to the body. It's by no means tight, but it doesn't have the blousiness that you saw 
in the Jasper, in the Avery, in the Dakota. It doesn't have all that, the tailored tucks so that you can have blousiness through the front. It actually is designed to sit a little bit closer to the body, can be worn out, but of course can be tucked in too. Very simplistic shape. I love that very soft scoop, sort of in between a scoop and a boat neck because it sits quite high, long sleeves, bust dots for shaping, so if you've got a full bust, it's still gonna work as well as if you've got a more um, narrow bust, and it's just that very simple shape. I know whenever we re release her in black, literally flies out the door, and then we retop, and they fly out the door again, so such a great shape. I'm trying to think your mum got one too, hey? She got a matey she, black. She got the black one. Yeah, she yeah, got that She wanted black. something to go with everything. Yes, so. which, which she does, so just very, um, simplistic shape which I love very elegant and um, I think that's why it's become such a popular shape amongst our following and then in this print we're just showing you again it's just another abstract print um, but this one with a bit of color compared to what we had on earlier in um, the monochrome <laughs> and monotone <laughs> but um, I just absolutely love that and that's also beautiful yeah I just wanted to show you the um, the jet dress compared to the heather dress that uh, Tracy had on earlier. So the heather dress in the new uh, Thornbirds print, which is beautiful, but you'll remember that that had the dramatic shoulder, you know, the, the gatherings on the shoulder that created a bit of drama yes. on the shoulder and the beautiful ruching up the sleeve as well. This The jet dress is... Um, have said this for many years, one of my favourite styles because I put this on and I feel like I have shape mm. pretty straight up and down in my body. But whenever I put this dress on, oh. I feel like I have. An yeah, it gives you the curves, it hey. Gives me, it creates the curves. That yeah, Gail, um, who's in our marketing team, she also yeah. like, loves the jet. It's beautiful. I, I love the flash of skin that you just get at the at the neckline with this beautiful little collar, little peak. Mm. It's just a. Just like a grown on, grown on collar, yeah. yeah. I was gonna say Peter Pan, it's not that. Um, just a three quarter sleeve, so that means I don't have to pull it up. <laughs> I've tied it up with the bow at the back today, which I've not done before. I haven't oh. tried the bow at the back, but it really gives a much more streamlined look yeah. through the um, through the body when you're looking straight on at the dress. Of course, it just finishes below my knee. I'm in the size ten, I'm on 169 centimeters, so it just finishes below my knee. Perfect length for work. This is just a really sweet go anywhere for work type of dress that, um, again, it's one of those things that gives you confidence. So I'd walk into an office, I'd walk into the boardroom and I'd feel really confident in this dress. And I think that that's ultimately what we're looking for when we're putting on LMF um, garments. It's that confidence boost. Yeah. And that you put something on and you automatically stand up a little taller, you lift your chest up a little bit, you lengthen your neck and you lift your head and you know that you are looking as good as you are feeling mm. and that's what I love about everything that I put on. Mm. Did you show how the skirt at the bottom is different to that? Um, you know how the head and head has got a little bit of a tiny bit of chill shape. This is not, this is just a straight around. Yeah. Um, so yeah, again there's no pockets, there's no lining but um, you could easily wear one of our wraps underneath just for a little bit more coverage. Um, but yeah, the mini slip works really well underneath. With this one, yeah. yeah. And you could pick, you could go navy, you could wear the black easily as well. Um, what other colours have we We've got? We've got latte as well. Oh, latte, yeah. yeah. You, really, I like, if I'm going to wear a slip, I actually like it peeking out a little bit. Oh, do you? Yeah, I do. Cause I think okay. that, yeah. So do you like the curve shaped slip then? Like yeah, you go for a curve? I would. Okay. Yeah, I would. Nice. But um, yeah, beautiful. Lovely. Dress. Beautiful. Lovely. Dress. So just when I've popped on the Sandy, I just want to mention to you, so if you're new to Sandy and you pop her down, when you look down into the keyhole, it does could look a little bit beagleicious. <laughs> Especially if you're very it, full in the bus. I got a fright. Yeah. And when you look down, it's a very different view from what you get when you're looking from the front. So I just wanted to say that to you. Um, have a look and if you're feeling a little bit concerned, get someone else's opinion. Um, in your home and just say, hey, am I popping out of this? If that's what you're concerned about, if you want it to be really delicious, then power to you. But I just thought I'd mention that because when I looked down, I was like, whoa, I need to go and adjust that. But looking in the mirror, I was like, oh, no, I'm okay. So just showing you back with the beautiful denim jacket. This is our um, Deegan jacket. Oh, Brady. Oh, sorry, Brady jacket. So just everything you've seen here is available in sizes 8 to 24. We're really, really proud of that offering. Everything's manufactured right here in Australia, except for our jacket. So our jackets, I mean, our denim um, products. Our denim product, we did do a, um, what, 
how would we say it, Haley? We did a little collaboration with Outland um, Denim. With Outland Denim, we did try and we did release a small denim collection last year, and we found that manufacturing here in Australia, we couldn't quite get the quality of the denim or the quality of the machinery needed for the products that we release. So those are the only pieces that have been um, made offshore. But everything else, we support lots of small makers local makers and people around the country, but all available in sizes 8 to 24. And generally you'll see releases every Wednesday and Friday, but if you join our group, if there's any little sweet treats, any little sneak peeks, anything like that, you find out first in the group. So you are privy to that. Um, that looks cool. Oh, I love that. You see, I love it with the all, with the all black yeah. as well. And so we thought that uh, I would pop on the Munros as well, just so that you can see the difference in height mm. uh, and length on myself. Still a perfect height for me, really yeah. happy with it. I could easily put flats on still and yeah. that'd be fine. Looks really sharp. Yeah, there's look. that, there's that, um, that black Avery top, it just, it doesn't matter what you're gonna put it with, it's always gonna look fantastic. I feel like that is a classic piece to add to your wardrobe. Yes. Um, even just one of those, there's the iterations like the Glen top as well. So you've got all those yeah. iterations, whether you wanted the bow or the long sleeve or the three quarter sleeve, um, they sit there, you can have a look on the website, but once you find your fit, you know that you can have a little play with those pieces. But thanks everybody for joining us. That's us for today. We um, hope you've enjoyed seeing us style it our way. And um, we will see you on Friday. Things might be a bit yeah. different on Friday. If you want to know what's happening on Friday, hop, hop over to our private community and um, ask to join that one, fill in all the questions, and then you'll be privy first. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> <laughs> see you. Bye. Bye.